Hello again, everybody. Okay, this is a trick called the magic square. And I've seen this before, and I had to ask my friend Singing Banana, and he explained this to me perfectly. He's a brilliant mathematician, and once you learn this, and it's pretty simple once you learn it, people will think that you're a brilliant mathematician too. So, what you do is you ask somebody to give you a two-digit number between 22 and 99. And let's say they say the number is 45. You're going to start filling in the boxes. So, let's say we put 25 over here, 5 here, uh, let's put 7 here, 9 here, uh, we'll put uh, 4 here, we'll put 1 here, 8 here, this will be 11, uh, 12, let's put 10 right over here, um, let's put 3 here, 6 over here, uh, hmm, uh, let's go 26 right here, 24 right over here, 27 right over here, and 2 right over there. Okay, the number is 45, and what I just did was, if you add up this row across, the numbers will add to 45, this row, the numbers add to 45, this is 45, and this is 45. Go straight down, this column is 45, add these numbers, it's 45, at these numbers, it adds up to 45, and these numbers. If you add the four corners, the numbers add up to 45. If you take any block of four squares, a, a two, two, two by two block, these numbers will add to 45, these numbers will add to 45, these numbers will add to 45, these numbers will add to 45. Take a block of three and add the corners. Eight and two is 10, and nine is 19, and 26 is 45. Take this block of 3. 11 and 24 is 35, and 10 is 45. If you take diagonally, 1 and 11 is 12, and you take these numbers diagonally, 27 and 6 is 33, 12 and 33 is 45. Try it this way. 26 and 5 is 31, 12 and 2 is 14, 31 and 14 is 45. There are 28 possible combinations of getting the number 45. So, let me show you how this is done. All you need to know are 12, the 12 numbers, numbers 1 through 12, and then this is the way you can remember it. What you want to do is remember the number 9. So, multiples of 9. In the first column, you want 54, going down right over there. You want 18, going down right over there. You want 36, going down right over there, and 72. So 5 and 4 is 9, 1 and 8 is 9, 3 and 6 is 9, 7 and 2 is 9. Remember that. Then the bottom right corner, you want to put a 9. Then for 10, 11, and 12, remember a zigzag. You want 10 over here, 11 over here, and 12 over here. That's all you need. Now, whatever number they give you, all you need to do is fill in these four squares, and it will work every time. So... Those four squares are going to be known as A, B, C, and D. Now, in our example with the number 45, for A, what we do is we subtract 20. So that would give us 25 in, where is that position right there? Right here. Go back. A, B, C, and D. So, a, we subtract 20 from the number they give us. So they give us 45, we subtract 20, and that's what goes in A. B, we add 1 to that number. So the number 25, we add num 1 to the number, so that's 26 in the B position. C position is right over here. We add another 1 to that number, and the D position is right over here, and we subtract 1 from this number. <clears throat> this works Every time, let's try one more time. If we know that the person's giving us the number, let's say, um, 50, okay? Again, we know this is a 5, this is a 4, this is a 1, this is an 8, this is a 3, a 6, a 7, a 2, a 9, and this is 10, this is 11, this is 12. The number is 50. Because the number is 50, we want to take 20 off, and this becomes a 30, then we want to add 1 for B, so this becomes a 31. 
We want to add another one for C. So this becomes a 32. And we want to take one off of the 30 for D. So this becomes a 29. And now add all these up and every possible combination will be 50. So if this didn't make any sense, which it probably doesn't, watch this over again. And then watch it again. And then watch it again. And all you need to know is where the first 12 numbers go and then deduct 20 and you'll know where A, B, C, and D go and there'll be 28 possible combinations of coming up with the number that the person gives you. This will blow people away. It's called the magic square and like I said, this will be hard for you to get the first time. You might not understand a word I said, but go over it, watch it, try it yourself and you'll see that it is amazing. That's it. I'll see you next time.